from Vienna, where people want to be bothered less, not more, welcome to Sucks Talk Politics. Hello and welcome back to Socks Talk Politics. Tonight, I want to start off with a simple question. Hey, Brian, do you have a minute? Tonight, I want to start off with kids' simple question. Good, I need to talk to you. Actually, I need to talk to all of you. What's going on, kid? When we started this show, we started it together. Brian, Fred, Nancy, me, and producer Sock, who... I think he's really just Fred with headphones on. Aye, not true. We wanted to bring about change. Together. But somehow, it seems like this show is only about one person. We never get a say in what the episode should be about. What? Never get a say? You guys are constantly hijacking the show. Please, Brian, let me speak. For once. (sighs) We are part of this show, and we want to contribute. That is why I am demanding more deliberation with the whole team to decide on the big issues in a democratic process. What big issues? You can be part of this movement, too. Sign my petition for more involvement of all socks who talk politics. (sighs) How do you always come up with something like this? I heard that in Ireland, citizens were able to co-design their socking constitution and it turned out darn well. Maybe this show could also profit from some direct democracy. Citizens were able to do what? Co-design their constitution. You know, the foundation of a nation? I know what a constitution is. The so-called Constitutional Convention was a major experiment in deliberative democracy in Ireland. Composed of 66 randomly chosen citizens, 33 parliamentarians from all parties, and an independent chairperson, the convention discussed proposed amendments to the Constitution of Ireland. They considered eight specified issues and also selected two others additionally. The government committed to respond formally to each recommendation. One result of the Constitutional Convention was the referendum of 2015, in which Ireland became the very first country in the world to approve same-sex marriage by popular vote. Constitution. No. Constellation. No. Constipation. Uh, Brian? What? Oh, uh, so, sorry. Yeah, no. Uh, hey, I get your point. Seriously. So, um, what do you want, kid? Well, this isn't just about me, Brian. But since you're asking, I think we should all be able to choose our own job titles. Ah, I see. And you have one in mind? Sass. Sass? That's right. Senior Advisor of Sock Supervision. Sass. Senior Advisor of Socks. Aha. Uh-huh. It's, uh, <laughs> so you're like a boss now. Sure, if you want to interpret it that way, Brian. I mean, I'm not going to stop you. Uh, all right, I'll play along. <laughs> Your royal sassness, may I close out the show? Hmm. I'll allow it. Thank you. Well, that's it for tonight. We had a wonderful show, and we'll see you next week on Socks Talk Politics. Until then, happy Pride Month, and stay on your toes. So what else is on your list? Well, um, I thought a gaming arcade in the studio would be great to relieve stress. Relieve stress? You are the major producer of stress yeah. in the studio. I beg your pardon. That is no way to talk to your sass. Okay. Well, then what else is on the list? Uh, ping pong table? We have no arms. Oh, you're right.